Well, hello first grade. Our vegetables are all dry and we're going to move right on to the next step. So you're going to be using some art sticks today and art sticks are really a colored pencil without the wood. So you're going to use these to add a little bit more detail to your vegetables. I'm going to start with the carrot actually. So I have an orange art stick and I'm going to go around the edge near that black outline and I am just going to make a nice dark orange line around that. And then I could go probably back in and maybe where those lines that we made. And if you didn't get a chance to make them, then we're going to make them with that orange. Now I'm going to try some green up here for the where the uh, green part of that carrot is. Now I don't have to color on top of the color in where the watercolor is. I'm just adding a little bit of that dark green to give it um, a little bit more detail. So now I'm going to go to the pepper and I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to go right around this pepper. I might darken up that stem a bit. I'm going to go around here. So you're going to do this to all of your vegetables. The one that might be a little bit tricky is the eggplant. Let's see what that looks like. Oh no, that looks good. Okay, so you're just going around where you outlined. Now I'm not going to finish up mine, but of course when I get going it just like I want to finish it. All right. Okay, I got to stop because our video is going to be too long. So the next step what you're going to do is you're going to cut out all your vegetables. And when you go ahead and cut them out, be very careful. Okay, you want to cut, make them look great. And I'm just going to cut this and then I can finish getting in here, cutting right up close, okay? So you're going to cut all of your vegetables out. I've already done that with a different set of vegetables. But what you're going to do next is you're going to get this big piece of blue paper and you're going to have a choice of color that'll be, this is going to be the table that your basket's going to sit on. So I picked orange and you're going to glue your construction paper table down to the big blue paper just like that. Then you're going to get something you haven't seen in a while. Remember this that you made? The basket? You're going to flip it over. You're going to put glue on the side of the basket, at the bottom of the basket, on this side of the basket, you're just not going to put it along the top, not yet. And then I'm going to place the basket on my table. Just like that. All right, so here's my vegetables that I have cut out already, see? So now I get to arrange the vegetables in my basket. Now I don't want to stick them down so far that you can't see a lot of it. I'm just going to maybe stick that like that and the tomato like that, just a little bit underneath the basket so you can still see a lot of that vegetable, okay? And you're just gonna arrange them and I like to have my vegetables overlap each other just a little bit. When you're happy with the way they look, you're gonna glue your vegetables in place. And that finishes our still life stew.